After all, we are looking for a high detailed rule to play on, we are looking for an authentic experience while we are driving trains around the world, and in my opinion the best real experience that I can get from this simulator are from the German routes. Either I'm looking for a high speed experience or the shunting services, those German routes have their own unique way to bring something different through our universe. Uh, the safety systems that they are coming with are pretty unique, are pretty awesome and fun to drive. But I let someone else talk about this. My name is Alex and today I'm gonna talk about the next German root release, Dresden to Chemitz. And uh, I want to start by apologizing <laughs> for my future mistakes in my pronunciation. Uh, I'm gonna attach the name of the of the cities and so on on the screen so I'm trying to avoid uh, misunderstanding and this kind of stuff. Thunder Ramp is a German route between Dresden to Chemnitz. Uh, the entire length of the route is 80 kilometers. This route is uh, filled up with viaducts, sharp turns, numerous small towns, uh, challenging gradients and the speed the limit the speed limit of uh, this route is 120 km per hour let's talk about uh, the rolling stock coming with the route which is the dbbr 612 dbbr 143 under the red db livery the 185.5 which is a really special unit for me under the rail pool silver livery that's pretty unique and the 636 from the for the shunting services the 143 unit have numerous services under the S3 line with a section of the line long as uh, 40 kilometers uh, but uh, have numerous services around the entire length of the route calling at all stops on the other hand the 612 uh, is a regional express unit is still in production since 1998. A total of nine, 192 units has been built up to this point and is capable of a top speed of 160 km per hour resulting from all of the 751 horsepower engines placed under the each coach. But the piece of resistor is the way this unit is running around the route because when we are seeing 612 we are thinking about uh, tilting future uh, into the game uh, and this will have a big impact uh, on the game as well. We all know some of the other units around the world like Acela from America is using the same kind of uh, physics so I'm really, I'm really uh, looking for this uh, route. And also because uh, 612 is using a brand new safety system specific for the tilting cranes and uh, is called GNT. Basically all I know about this is that uh, GNT is running on PSB and is a safety system that allows trains to achieve a 30% speed increase on curves being only used as a tilting train system. So as I told you before I'm really curious how this will come and how this will work into the game physics. So we already know the 612 is going all the way as a regional express train so he will use the uh, avoiding line for uh, his run. Uh, it will uh, have uh, limited stops. It's not really a busy route and all of the passenger services are operated with a 143 and the 612. So there's not gonna be other DLCs as a layer for these passenger services. I don't have any idea when this will come out. Uh, hopefully it will come out uh, during January of the next year and they told us uh, uh, from their article this will come out soon so I'm assuming it will come out uh, on the January during the next year uh, of course they will do preview streams and uh, more news will come out from uh, their official site uh, but till then don't forget to subscribe to, to this channel to be up to date every time when something new is coming out and uh, to be able to 
uh, create your own liveries based on our liveries that we are doing on this channel uh, of course we have uh, our discord server link into the description down below so make sure you will check that out also we are a nice community and you are welcome there so i was alex this was alex in game channel and till the next time stay safe guys thank you very much